I'm going to be completely honest, I don't like this tower. And the reason why I don't like it is simple. Every single time after, let's say, Battle 120, uh, every single time when I try to use Auto Combat, in a lot of cases, it takes on average 3 minutes for my team to finish the fight. And this is a team with pretty good powerful equipment, and this has never happened before in any other tower. Usually if I have equipment like this, Fusion 5, Fusion 6, Apex, Fusion 10 rares, I expect the battles to be like this, especially with this overpowered team, which in my opinion is the best team in the game. Still though, it is super super annoying. And now we have a fight against uh, bosses that they all heal on tack. <laughs> incredible. Absolutely incredible. Now, I don't really care how many attempts this is going to take. All I want to do is to uh, kill this nightmare team. By the way, only Leatherface doesn't heal, to be honest with you. On tack, Leatherface doesn't... Oh, wait, well, it's one for all. Okay, I didn't even see the modifier. It's okay, though. Okay. So, uh... I guess the strategy is kill them all. Uh, if I do... Sp I don't want to really, really do any special attacks on this Jason. Because he's going to get immortal. Uh, but about 25% health, so it's... Okay, Raiden. Raiden's passive doesn't want to work. Come on, tag out. This Jason is uh, annoying. He doesn't really want to tag out. It's okay. Come on, I want this Jason out. So I can eventually uh, Team Soak. Even though Team Soak is a little bit <laughs> difficult. He doesn't want to tag out. Seriously, he doesn't want to tag out. He just... Oh, finally, thank you very much. So, I'm going to snare this guy. <sighs> Unfortunately, he's going to snare me first. Alright, I'm going to snare him. And then I will try to Team Soak... Uh, Actually, so it's super unfortunate. Uh, that's great, I'm snared. <laughs> that's that's awesome. That is perfect. I should have I should have picked uh, Black Dragon team or something. And actually, the game froze. The game absolutely froze. All right, the game unfroze. The game unfroze, but I'm still uh, the thing. I'm still uh, powerless. Even though I generate a lot of power, actually I don't generate anything, so that's super unfortunate. And it doesn't seem by looking at the results right now that I'll be able to... Alright, finally! I got some power, but like... Did I actually get these guys soaked at all? At least I'm going to take down two of them. This is this is the plan, this is the ultimate goal. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Is there a hex modifier? Like, seriously? I didn't know! I honestly didn't know there was a Hex modifier. Ay, ay, ay. Oh, and he's on set... How did I, how did I set him on fire? I, I don't, don't even use Burning Vengeance so I, can, so I don't set them on fire. Oh, I hate this fight. I absolutely despise this tower. It is so... Like, quite frankly, I don't find the battle super difficult. On my beginner account I do, but not here. Uh, I just simply find them extremely annoying. This is the best way to describe it. It's annoying. Like, uh, you need to snare, then kill. However, since weak point attacks don't work, it's a little bit more difficult to snare. It's not impossible, but still, it's uh, it's not easy at the same time, right? Okay, I just killed one of them, which was embarrassing, but, uh, you know, Jason is uh, fortunate to fight. Oh, whatever, I'm going to do this, then I'm going to do special one, if he evades, yeah. Oh, he didn't invade, but Leatherface tagged in with... Did I actually... Even fight Leatherface? I don't remember fighting this guy. Wow. Anyways, guys. I think it's going to take two attempts now. In in this particular fight, the Hex is super, super annoying. I didn't even see that there was Hex. So the point of this video, after I beat this fight, I want to go all the way from 108 to 109 using this overpower team so I can see the fights. I want to see every single fight and which one of the fights can be potentially, potentially difficult. Uh, and then, uh, I don't know what's going to do then. I, I wish to finish the fight as soon as possible, as fast as possible. Again, it's not rain. Alright. Alright, he's going to become immortal. That's wonderful. And he's immortal for 15 seconds. Now, I'm going to give you a tip. Uh, if he's immortal and he's super low, you can kill him with X-Ray. So, this is something that you can do if he's immortal like this. His immortality is going to expire. And he's going to tag out. Of, of course, good uh, good thing is that Leatherface, uh, Leatherface cannot really uh, he cannot do anything. In the sense that no no I don't want to set anybody on fire. Please please expire. Fire is healing me, but I don't want to be healed. <laughs> please expire. Oh thank you very much. Brutalize this guy. Brutalize him. Oh he's constantly coming in and out with 25 percent. Look at this. Oh my god. Come on 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 come on. 37, 36, 35, 35? 
Okay, I I will just use Lucane. I don't care. I'm going to brutalize him. Yes! Okay, two attempts. It is what it is. Now the question is how many difficult fights follow? Uh, the biggest problem for any player in this tower is uh, looking uh, armor, because on tag they heal. The problem is that weak point attacks doesn't work, so uh, it's more complicated to actually... MK11 Cinder, oh, that's cool actually. So it's more complicated for you to snare, since weak point attacks doesn't work, so you have to find a character that actually do snare, or you can use an item that snares, I mean, you, you shouldn't really rely on... Uh, uh, on a weak point attack, so you have to use a skill or a gear that actually snares, not a gear that power drains so that you can use weak point attacks to snare. Anyways, uh, Battle 181 doesn't appear to be difficult, off balance is annoying, but it's not the end of the world, also blowback and the enemy team is not really incredible, and you can see by the health, they, they have like 400k, I mean usually the, the hardest fights, uh, they have about a million health, so this one is definitely not one of the hardest fights. Okay, one more special one, beautiful, he's dead, Raiden comes, oh, thank you, that was that was the perfect tag, he literally tagged me, and this, this stun is incredible, <laughs> look at this stun, he literally stunned me, then I stunned him, and he came out of his stun first, this is how long the stun of MK11 Raiden is, and I actually understand why, because his combo ender, uh, he can do combo ender only with one of his combos. So having the stun for longer duration makes sure that he can actually chain it. If it was short, it's going to be kind of useless on MK11 Raiden. Anyways, Battle 181 uh, doesn't appear to be difficult. Let's see Battle 182. Oh. Again, Jade is always a problem and one for all is always a problem. However, they don't have a lot of gear. And by looking at it, they don't have the bees that regenerate them. Look at this, they don't have any uh, any armor. So that's perfectly fine. This match is doable again. I know I'm doing all these fights with max, not with maxed out epics, but with great fusion epics with maxed out diamonds. However, I can still identify which of the harder fights, okay? This Jade has only 200 health, 200k 200 health. That's, that's not really something to worry about. Okay, Noob Cybot comes. <laughs> Look at the rocket in his face. Way to a special one. Finish him in the process. Oh, he actually survived. Oh, that's respectable achievement. So I'm going to do another special one. And this time I believe uh, he, he's gone. This time he's gone. But 183, not a big deal. They still don't have the armor. So, and I bet they're going to have 200, 300k health. Again, this should be considered an easy matchup. Let's see. Uh, what is the health of Kenshi? Uh, 351. It's better than before, the previous fight, but uh, still it's not really something uh, extraordinary. A gold team would be perfectly fine here. And the Ronin team has never been something super difficult to defeat. Like, not at all. Going to attack to Raiden. Raiden is going to do a special one. Finishing this guy in the process. And, yep. Yeah. Other 183 was a piece of cake. Now, usually they put difficult fights on 184 on that number. So I wonder where this is going to be the case now. 184 is... Okay, I don't care about the coins. 184 guys is... It should be a difficult match. It should be a difficult match. And it is. Empowered, it takes only one. Actually, it is difficult, but it's not horrible. So we have Lucane, uh, Jax, and Classic Movie Raiden. And uh, do they... Oh, Jax heals and Classic Movie Raiden heals. Okay. So, every single time when Jax and Classic Movie Raiden tags in, they're going to heal each other. So, hmm, I wonder whether, uh, I think Rain can survive, uh, like, I'd rather use a Classic Raiden though, uh, because uh, he has um, an armor that saves him from dying, so even if he somehow kills me, probably he will start with X-Ray, I don't know, let's see, uh, is he going to start with an X-Ray? Uh, no, with two bars of power, but that's enough. He's going to snare me, but that's not a big deal because I can uh, I do this and get unsnared immediately. Okay, so I'm going to do this, this. Look at this, he has 800k health. That's crazy, almost a million. Of course, the name of the game here, guys, is Dots. In this tower, remember, they don't have resistance to the buffs. This guy was so dumb, why he didn't do special 2? He could have literally killed me with his special 2. A million health. Again, a million health is easily wiped out with dots, even if you have Fusion 0 MK11 Scorpion. 
uh, unless they don't heal from uh, fire. Sometimes they heal from fire. This is the case, then you are in a lot of trouble. <laughs> Also, classic Raiden uh, special attack works pretty good. I'm uh, sorry, his attacking attack, not special attack. All right, because it will remove 40% of the health, no matter what. Okay, Jaxi boy is almost destroyed. Oh god, I'm still. Oh, I don't have, I don't have the. I don't even know what talents I have. Damn, I have to be more prepared for such videos. I have no idea what talents I'm using. Because currently I'm preoccupied with my beginner account, so on my main account I just I just give them any gear and any talents and that's it. I, I don't have time to uh, create some amazing strategies on my main account. And on top of everything, Onslaught launched uh, two days ago, so I'm currently also playing Onslaught. I will release the video shortly, uh, but still no time. So this fight isn't isn't really a big deal. This fight is okay. Again, as long as they don't heal from the dots, everything's fine. Oh, let's see what else do you have. Battle of 1984 was... Okay. Battle of 1985 is another difficult fight. Let's see. Dark Fate Terminator will heal. Okay, so only the Terminator heals. That's fine. I believe that's fine. Toxic Bomb Resurrect. Oh, Resurrection. That's so annoying. And I... Oh my god, I have to kill them so many times. Still though, if they can... If they're not healed from fire, just kill them all using fire. It's just that is simple. Or bleed or whatever way you feel comfortable doing it. The keyword is dots. It doesn't matter whether they have 1 million health. Seriously, it doesn't. But what I'm going to do now is... Uh, oh, Team Blind. That's beautiful. I'm going to do this. Oh, I didn't snare him. Why did I snare him? It was so dumb for me not to snare. He was Team Soccer. I didn't snare him. I was like... What was I thinking? This Cabal is the second most annoying character in the game after Jade. Jade uh, is number one and this guy is number two. This is how, how annoying he is. It seems that he's healing from fire. So I guess I guess bleed. Uh, I guess bleed will be the They have so many dots. I have no understand I no idea what happened. Some Oh I know, I know. One of my characters have uh, Shinta of Malice that gives you resistance to all the buffs and also Death mark on tag. So once I tagged Raiden, I believe he applied team death mark and it absolutely wrecked them. That was that was crazy. Uh, so yeah, if they're healing from fire, then you can just bleed or something. Yeah. Okay. What else do we have? A poison. Poison also works. However, poison doesn't really do a lot of damage. Okay, 186 is uh, should be easy. They don't have a lot of gear. I don't think I'll be covering everything, I just want to cover everything from 181 to 190, so you can see if there is uh, anything super super difficult. Okay, the guy comes with an x-ray, uh, fatal blow in his part, alright, should I? Yeah, I think I should kill him uh, using rain. Alright, he's weakened so his x-ray is not going to do a lot of damage. Uh, I'm going to kill this guy using my radon special too. I don't think it will be enough because of the modifier. It's okay though. I'm going to finish him like this. Now this is going to be enough. Bam! I heal as well. Okay. Special do. This should be enough. Okay, finish her. Finish her! Wow. Well, I didn't finish her. Next battle, guys! 197. Uh, doesn't seem like it's a black dragon team so you should never underestimate it but uh, they don't have a lot of health so it's not a lot of, it's not a big problem oh actually it is a problem because this guy has 700k health well i didn't see him having any armor so this health is wow all right i'm going to melt his health right away Bam! i hate black dragon team oh wow what were you thinking, my friend? What were the, the unblockable vampires? Okay. So Cabal. Cabal is going to be a problem. I have to be careful. I'm going to kill him. Ah! I couldn't do anything here. I was unable to tag out. Probably I should have waited a little bit before I killed Cabal. It doesn't matter though. Easy fight. Again, compared to other Fatal Tower fights, this com especially compared to other Fatal Tower fights with Black Dragon team, this one is super easy. I remember actually losing a fight with maxed out uh, diamond team with very good equipment 
granted I used bad, bad gear, not bad gear, but bad team to face the Black Dragon team, but I lost. So, um, yeah, this one wasn't one of the hardest Black Dragon fights ever. Alright, two more fights. This one is going to be easy again. They're missing a piece of equipment. Which of the modifiers? Enraged Bloody Bomb. Okay. Enraged fights, guys, are not really that, that difficult. I don't uh, know why many people find it difficult. Enraged fights, uh, yeah, since they're not regenerating, in my opinion, regeneration is one of the worst fights ever. If they're not regenerating, that's not a problem. You can always, again, use dots uh, and just melt them. Okay, I think this should be enough. And Sub-Zero has 300k health. Wow. Almost nothing. So again, if you have a gold team, you can give red card to, for instance, Scarlet and pray that Sub-Zero attacks in. He will immediately Sub-Zero and this fight is going to be easy. Let's see the next fight. Kitana support. It's incredible. It's absolutely busted. <laughs> what is the next fight? Please, give me something difficult. 189. 189. Alright. Okay, this one, this one appears to be difficult. Let's see. Alright, this one, this one should be hard. Johnny Cage is going to be a menace because he's going to have... Can, actually, I don't, I don't know, can you double the regeneration or anything? Like, what happens if you have two regenerations? Can you stack them? Never tested that. Alright, let's kill uh, this guy. Look at this, a million health with regeneration. Uh, difficult, you need to make sure uh, that you have poison. Oh, <laughs> okay, Johnny Cage says bye-bye. I mean, this is so busted on Classic Raider. You tag in and you do Team Deathmark. It's incredible. Uh, Johnny Cage... Oh, how? He's literally stunned. You see that? He was literally stunned. Okay, and now I'm blind, so I'm going to remove the blind like this. I don't want to tag out because he's going to uh, tag me back in. Which is not the end of the world. Okay, now I'm going to tag out. Just try to hit me, I'm going to intercept it. Bam! Wow, 800k, that wasn't even critical, little. Right, at this point, I'm just uh, overpowering the stage because of my gear and everything. But uh, again, I think this is this is doable. This is doable. The problem with goats is that you have to snare. If you don't snare in this fight, you're going to be in a lot of trouble. So, I reckon so far, this is going to be the, the hardest fight in the tower, in my opinion. The hardest one. Because of the inability to snare. If you're approaching with goats, it's going to be difficult. Much difficult than 184 and 185. Probably, again, you can give red card to Johnny. Because Johnny is the main threat. By giving red card, you'll make sure that he'll never regenerate. And then kill a scorpion. Yeah, that's the plan, I believe. You have to kill scorpion first. And give red card to Johnny so that he never attacks. Alright, next one. Battle 100, Inferno Power Search. This one, again, is going to be difficult. This one is going to be difficult, yeah. Especially, again, if you cannot snare. If you cannot snare... Oh my god, two of them regenerate on attack. Difficult one. Let's see. that mark yes see you on the other side going to do special too unfortunately uh not many the boss on this guy i i wanted i expected that mark but unfortunately it will never happen he really did that right he did that <laughs> a million health oh my god look at the damage i'm doing with Regular hits. That's incredible. Uh, I have no idea why I didn't give Classic Rain any really decent tower gear. Like, uh, he doesn't really do tons of damage. Okay, I'm going to kill this guy. He's annoying. I think you should be enough. Yep. Okay, the death mark. The best thing about uh, this tower, if I can say there is a best thing, is that at least once you kill him, they don't have any type of gear that bring them back. So, uh, it's unfortunate that they resist fire, they heal by it. Uh, it's unfortunate that they heal more or less every single time. It is unfortunate that you cannot snare them by power draining, but at least once you kill them, that's it. At least. Another fight, please, give me something good. Something good. So far, I believe 189 is the hardest one. A hex. 
this one is not difficult. Uh, since uh, they don't have uh, any regeneration, they won't have a lot of health. So even without dots, you'll be able to beat this one. Um, yeah, this guy has 200 health. Okay, health. That's that's nothing. Even my even my rain deals a lot of damage to him. Of course, the hex is always annoying. Oh, <laughs> I love the damage uh, from uh, the Nunchaku. It's absolutely busted, and still they haven't fixed it. It is it, not really serious. You cannot do that much damage on tag. Like I can literally win the game by simply tagging it out, and then expect the Nunchaku to do the damage. You don't do anything else. Just tagging it out. It's not serious. They have to fix that. Okay, brutality. No. He did. Alright guys, so we have one last fight. This was a very, 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 very long video, but what can you do? Sometimes I do long videos, I hope you enjoy them. Uh, the last fight is going to be against... Give me something good. I want worthy opponents. The last fight is going to be against... Oh, this one... I mean, the Arctic Wind is always an annoying modifier, but at the end of the day, I don't think it's super, super difficult. Again, they're missing a piece, so they won't have a lot of health. Uh, yeah, so that's pretty cool. Especially, yeah, 270 is nothing. Uh, I want to do this, but I want to do Team Deathmark. Yes! <laughs> I love I love this attack, Team Deathmark. It is so, so busted. Okay, special 2, killing sub 0 in the process. And this is going to conclude the video. Unfortunately, I don't have any more, uh, like, uh, refreshes. I wasted two attempts with battle 120 uh, due to the game crashing and due to the AI having no idea how to beat bosses and you witnessed me uh, wasting one attempt with battle 180 so at the end of the day I'm missing three attempts if uh, you're playing flawlessly you have very good gear but now you should have been in battle 196 uh, it should be not available for you to do but you should be able to see it Currently, I'm battle, I should be at battle 193, if I'm not mistaken, so you can see it. Uh, yeah, 193 again doesn't seem to be a little bit of a problem. So, we saw all battles from 181 to 193. Uh, I think that there is one fight that's going to be a problem, the one with... Um, I mean, a lot of fights had the potential to be difficult, but there was one, in my opinion, that should be the most uh, difficult one. Uh, the, the fight with the um, Strike Force team. So remember to give red card to Johnny, because he's, in my opinion, the biggest problem. All right, guys, this is going to be all for me today. See you next time. Take care and have an amazing rest of your day. Perfect.